Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Survival Island. Back here on the island. And today we're going to talk about this series and gonna do a wrap up of the last episode. All right, let's get started. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, last episode, we finally went on our journey out and about, and we found some interesting things, uh, some of which was kind of odd to me, like that village up to the north, the Savannah Village, that didn't quite look like a Savannah Village. I think that was in the truncate, and then it did not regenerate correctly. Probably, it, you know, the, the way chunk regeneration works it just may not have worked quite like i had intended and that's fine so we've got this weird savannah village up to the north that doesn't look like a 1.10 savannah village so we'll just have to deal with that it is not nighttime so what we're going to do is just have a chat about what this means for the series and what it means overall we do have carrots in our agricultural wing. Let's come over here and we'll take a little kind of a, a tour of the various things that we have done in this series. So first things first, we started out on this island. We had a couple of trees and, oh, I'm going the wrong way. A couple of trees and some chickens and we've molded this island to suit our needs. We've cut back the profile a bit just to minimize the overall uh, overall footprint and you know one thing we can do we've got plenty of render distance I've been keeping it at a lower render distance in order to hide the fact that there was a jungle right over there the reason we did that I picked this seed on purpose I did it on purpose because I was going through looking at potential seeds for the hypermine reset back in March and I came across a few survival island type deals and I found one that had a jungle island on it and I have always been partial to jungle islands it goes back to my uh, first first single player series that was a jungle island if you have been around since the since those days you will remember that as jungle island adventures and that was season one and it ended uh, well, honestly, I can't, I can't quite remember probably about the time that we got going on Hypermine. And the reason that we stopped that is because you can only handle so much of one series in vanilla Minecraft if you're doing the kind of recording I was doing at the time. So at that time, I would be doing large projects and so there'd be a lot of off-camera work and then trying to do the cuts in between uh, it would end up taking a long time to record one episode instead what I've tried to do with this particular series and um, and from the beginning and and that is get better at commentating while also doing projects and hopefully I've gotten pretty good at that or at least better surely there is room for improvement but that's the whole point of practice is to continually improve and what we're going to do is we're going to go over to this island that I had suspected from the very beginning of holding all of the passive mobs and keeping me from getting any passive mobs on my uh, forest area back there so we got a sheep over here and cows and pigs we'll see if we can get this sheep to pay attention to us Come here, sheep. Okay, he's coming. He's coming. Okay. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to start the the breeding up over here. He may have lost interest. That's fine. So I'm going to be breeding these things up in order to kind of get this, this process started. So here, here. Okay, good, good, good. And we've got a couple of pigs. We had another pig. Did we lose one? I think we may have lost one. Hmm. Yeah, we may have lost a pig. 
Is there one over here? No, it might have fallen down. Anyway, so I picked this seed. I saw it as a jungle island that was not at spawn. So that means that we could do some crazy mechanics over in that area and not, not cause problems with the overall, um, overall world. Uh, like at uh, Jungle Island Adventures Season 1, we had a crazy mob or crazy iron farm and a mob farm. And anyway, the lag, you know, could, could be pretty bad sometimes. Of course, I didn't have the greatest computer at that time either. But um, I wanted to have something where I could do those crazy projects and not, uh, not cause a bunch of lag. So um, that, that, that was a guiding decision for that particular um, map find. And hopefully I've shared the seed with you by now. If not, it's going to be in the description box below. But uh, one thing we're not going to do is we are not going to be doing a world download anytime soon. I want to keep this to myself for now. Hopefully, hopefully you don't mind that so much, but um, I, uh, I just want to do that. So long term, what does it mean for this series? Well, Survival Island is over. This Today's episode, this little epilogue, if you will, is going to be the final episode of Survival Island. It's going to remain at season one. We're not going to do a season two. If we happen to do one in the future, it's going to be on a different seed and we'll find something else, some other concept to run with. At, uh, at that time. But for now, we're just going to, um, we're going to go into like a Jungle Island Adventures Season 2. We've got a new island, got a new map, and we're going to try and keep this one for a long time. So even if there are terrain generation updates, we're going to keep it. And we're not going to do any more truncation. Uh, what we may end up doing is pulling in snapshots from time to time. And if we do some exploration, uh, we'll do it on a backup, and if we find something that we like, well, we will uh, go with the backup and uh, and then make note of the coordinates of interesting things just to keep the map size to a minimum. But long term, we do have projects of plenty to do here. One, we need to set up an actual base, and we're not going to be living there at spawn. We're going to live here on the Jungle Island in uh, or we're going to start our adventures over here. And I'm thinking this bay area might might be good. I probably should have brought some, uh, some maps. Maybe I should go make some maps. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go back to the survival island and make some maps. But I really like that cove right in there. So that might be our starting point. And what I really wanted to do way back on Jungle Island Adventure Season 1 I wanted to have an overworld base where we had, where we were doing a lot of stuff in the trees. So we're having pathways and buildings in inside the trees. Jungle just cries out for that, really. So I wanted to kind of honor the that that concept, and I never really got into it. Now, does this mean it's going to be a regular series? No, no, no. I can't. I can't do that. It has been rather difficult keeping three Minecraft series going. So we are going to be dropping back to two Minecraft series, one vanilla on the Hypermind server and one modded on my Sky Factory. And there's potential um, for some some new modded stuff coming up in the future. The reason why is that FTB is almost done with their FTB Infinity 1.10.2 pack. I'm not sure what that is going to entail, but, uh, but uh, that is coming up here towards the end of September. What were we coming over here to do? Make a map. That's what we need to do. So let's see about getting a few maps, and that means we need some iron. I'm getting kind of low on iron, and that's an idea for another project. Here at Spawn, we are going to do another project. We're going to build an iron farm, and I've got just the iron farm in mind. We're going to put it right here. That's why I've kept this area clean. That's where I want the iron farm. It's going to be in spawn chunks. We may have to start running this thing as a server, so I'll be doing that from my computer. So I'll run it as a server. That way, the spawn chunks will be loaded all the time. Um, if you aren't aware, if you're using Optifine, it actually unloads the spawn chunks. So you have to 
you have to kind of work with that. So we're going to do do a multiplayer server, but only I'm going to be invited, and occasionally my camera account. But but uh, yeah, we do need an iron farm, and then we've got the potential for a dual blaze farm over in the Nether. You know what? I can't do maps yet because I need this sugar cane to grow, which means I need. A sugarcane farm. See, there's there's so much. There's so much still to do, but we're going to be doing that off camera. So what we may end up doing is um, we're going to be potentially bringing in some more streaming in the future. So um, so keep that in mind. So we might be doing streaming from Jungle Island Adventures Season 2 map. And we may end up doing... Um, well, what we will end up doing, if we don't end up streaming, and I'm just playing here on the map, uh, what I'll do is occasionally offer a recap. So what has changed since the last time we were together? We've done that a little bit here. We had some, you know, I did a bunch of stuff off camera, like uh, fleshed out the agricultural wing and then built these extensions over here and, and messed with the mining area down below. So we've got a number of things that we have done already like that and we'll continue that so when I do projects I'll bring you back show you a recap of how I built it and what I built and all that fun stuff the design decisions that went into it so um, so yeah the other thing is we need um, we need to find a witch hut we need to find uh, an ocean monument we need to go fight the ender dragon there's so many projects still to do here we've only just scratched the surface there's plenty of content we'll uh, we'll be doing and you know what for the inter dragon fight we will do that here together we'll go out find the stronghold and go fight the inter dragon because i haven't done that with you in 1.10 we've done it in 1.7 i think fought the inter dragon a couple times here but uh or here on the channel but we haven't done it in 1.10 yet so i missed the one on hypermine uh, just it didn't work out schedule wise but uh, what we're gonna do is um We'll do that together here. So we've got a blaze farm, iron farm, various things like that. And uh, anyway, so what I wanted to do is just bring you along and just give you an idea of some of the things that went into this map. I chose this map for the purpose of eventually going to that jungle island right over there. That was the whole point. And hopefully you enjoyed the journey. It was a lot of fun getting to that point, just, you know, kind of working through a few, uh, a few limitations that we set ourselves. You know, creativity is, uh, or limitations are uh, help, help creativity. It's one of the things that I really like. I like setting a limitation and seeing what we can do within that realm. And so this one, we weren't allowed to leave the island until we got our chicken farm and got, got a beacon. So I think it ended up pretty well. We've got uh, a little collection going on here. We still need one more, uh, one more tree, one more type of tree. You know, we might be able to go find that too. I I did run the overviewer map and I found a taiga off to the south and east, down past the the jungle island here. And uh, let's see. Eventually, we will have a network in the nether so our nether portal there at spawn will go into a nether hub of sorts and we may do the nether hub off of the jungle island because that's where we're going to be spending most of our time eventually now here at spawn we'll have a few more projects but i think the iron farm is the next major project and then from there um we'll be here at jungle island so the rest of the farms like the sugarcane farm melon farm all those we will do those over here uh, we're not going, going to be uh, doing much more there at spawn i think we've got enough there we'll turn off the general mob farm and we'll probably do another general mob farm over an ocean somewhere so it's a little bit more efficient but uh, but yeah just to give you an idea of things coming we are not going to shut down um, the this map we're going to continue with the map but it does mean we're going to be changing up how this whole thing works so just to give you an idea so let me know what you think about all that how do you uh, what did you think about uh, going into jungle island or finding a jungle island did you did you like that concept hopefully you did 
and hopefully didn't come as too abrupt of a change for you. But um, yeah, we're going to come over here, grab some of this spruce. I did bring an axe. That's a good thing. We'll just grab a couple of trees. There are tons, tons of jungle around here, which is really good. Really good indeed. Can we get off the boat? Okay, there we go. And, uh, you know, we've got a few other biomes to explore. Um, one thing to note is that I chose this seed purely for the fact that it had a jungle island. I've looked at a midst, and you can look in a midst as well uh, with the seed for it, and you'll find we're nowhere close to ice spikes. We're nowhere close to a mesa. Uh, we're nowhere close to a mushroom island. So uh, in terms of seeds where you're looking for all those biomes close by, this is not a good seed, but it does have one thing in particular. It's got a jungle island, and that's what I was looking for. And, uh, and yeah, and it's got a survival island at spawn, so we can remove that island or remove the grass there and pull out the chicken farm, and we can build a passive mob farm somewhere. We're going to do that here. We're only prepping the area on the Hypermind server. I'm not going to build that farm. I'm going to leave that. Kondrick had expressed an interest, so I may leave that for him to do. But, uh, but yeah, we're not going to be doing that. So uh, just to give you an idea of potential, if you were wondering about potential overlap, it's not going to happen. Um, we'll build one here, but not on Hypermind. But anyway, I'm going to run around here a little bit. We've got what, planes over there. Do we have any more taiga? It'd be nice if we found like a mega taiga and got some pods all going, but uh, no, no such luck. It looks like. Come over here. Planes. Yep, just planes. Bunch of pigs. It's a good thing. And I don't want to go too far. We just wanted to come over and get some spruce, and I think that completes our tree collection. We've got dark oak, oak, birch, acacia, jungle, and now spruce. So not too shabby. Oh, there's cows. That's a good thing. Yeah, I think I lost a pig on that other island. I think it just uh, just disappeared. All right, so I don't see a mega tiger around. I'll probably have to look around on a midst for that. Um, we're generating too much too much terrain here. I don't like it. So. Um, I want to keep the map size kind of small, so we're going to head back to the boat and go back to our jungle, our survival island, and then we'll we'll just figure it out from there. So anyway, this is going to be the end of Survival Island with Soap the Great. Hopefully you enjoyed the series. Leave a like if you did, and if you enjoyed this particular um, explanation of the overall thinking behind behind the series. And uh, anyway, be watching for Jungle Island Adventures Season 2, Episode 1 coming up uh, in the near future. I'm not sure what project is going to be first, but it'll probably be a recap video rather than a, uh, an actual um, Let's Play type deal. Because again... Uh, if we were to do the Let's Play type deal here, what we'd end up doing is a bunch of small episodes, each of a little bit of functionality on a particular project, and we might do that. So let me know what you think about that, actually. If you would prefer recaps, or if you would prefer to, uh, to do a bunch of small episodes, short episodes, and a little bit of progress on a particular project at a time. So I'd love to hear what you have to say about that. But for now, Whatever Wednesdays is going to go back to indie games that I come across. We've still got plenty to go in Car Mechanic Simulator 2015. And yes, we're almost done with 2016. But we've got some DLC to go through in that game. We're going to be running through that. We still need to get to, um, to getting our parking lot going and building our own cars or, or doing our own projects rather than just taking customer orders uh, for repairs. So uh, we're, we're going to be getting back to that. We've also got a few other games in play. Got a new multiplayer server 
that I want to play around with. Uh, I might be playing with Caleb. Do you remember Caleb from back in the Building the City days? Uh, fellow co-worker. He's been playing some other games, and he found one that uh, I've actually gotten a hold of, and he found a good multiplayer server, and Kondrick might join us too. No promises for Kondrick or, or Caleb either, but uh, there's, there's a potential for some additional... Uh, additional games there. So whatever Wednesday, we'll be switching back to non-Minecraft unless, you know, you guys decide that you don't mind a little bit of progress on a small project at a time. So uh, do let me know. We're going to head back to the back side, the boat dock over here. And, and we'll just pull this in. We'll plant our spruce and bid adieu. So, uh, so yeah, hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, a like is always appreciated. And if you haven't done so already, think about subscribing so you are up to date with everything going on on the channel. That doesn't go there. That goes here. We'll put this over here. And sugarcane we will put out here. And it has grown a little bit. Awesome. So we will probably have to ring the entire island with that just for now. And let's get spruce growing right here. All right. There we go. All right. And uh, also a reminder, we've got a Q&A special potentially coming up. It might, we might have hit the, hit the milestone at this point by the time this one comes out. I don't know. But uh, if we did, we're looking at a 10 stack special. Uh, 640 subscribers, we're going to do a Q&A. If you have any questions for that and it has not already come out, leave them in the comment section down below or catch me on Ask.fm or on Twitter. That's going to be it for now, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching. And that is it from Survival Island. Bye-bye.